What's up, guys? Hello, brothers and sisters. I hope you're having a wonderful day today. I'm just coming here to have another nature talk with you, you know? Just breathing in that prana. Walking on the beach here. I guess you could call this a beach shoreline. It's beautiful, man. This is Nova Scotia. This is where I'm from. Grateful. So that's what I really want to talk about today, honestly. Just a little bit. What I'm trying to talk about today is how to live in abundance and gratitude constantly. You know? It's all about reprogramming your mind. You know? Every single day I wake up in abundance. I just wake up and I'm like, you know what? I'm living in abundance and I'm so grateful for that. And because of that, because I choose to be grateful, you know, it can be the small things. I might taste a strawberry, it might be like the tastiest strawberry ever. And I'm just like, in that moment, I'm just like, so grateful, like this strawberry is vibrant, you see what I'm saying? Okay, so when it comes to being grateful and living in abundance, it's as simple as this, it's like, you start to reprogram your mind every day. You just slip thoughts in, it's just kind of like, all right, I'm grateful. And then just say that, and then choose to be grateful, you know? Choose some things in your life that you can be grateful for, because I mean, everyone, Everyone can choose to be ungrateful, you know, or grateful. It's really up to them. So one thing I want to say though is like, once you decide to be grateful, you just find more things to be grateful for. It's kind of like an exponential thing that happens, you see? It's kind of like, okay, I'm living in gratitude now. And then it's just like, all of a sudden things gravitate towards you that make you become more grateful. And the same thing with, the, with abundance. When you change your mindset from living as like a victim into just recognizing that there's no scarcity here. Like literally, this, is, this world is absolutely full of abundance. It's just waiting to be tapped in. Once you start to tap into that frequency of abundance, it's just like you live in it. Like, I don't worry about money. I just spend and it comes back. Because I got the energy, you know, because that's another thing. Currency. It's just a reflection of the energetic, like the currents, or you could say the currents of the sea, you know, electricity. It's just a reflection of how much energy you have in your body. I mean, that's another video in itself. So that's what it's about. It's just like... You know, Qigong, yoga, getting the body in shape, meditation, getting the mind in shape, and spirit, man, just... Doing things, following your passion, following your heart, you know? Getting in tune with who you truly are. So anyways, just coming back to what I was talking about, about living in gratitude. You know, it's, it's really all about how you place your focus because it's a lot to do with being an alchemist as well, you know? That's another thing, it's like, being an alchemist, you have a choice always because we live in a world of duality, polarity. It's one of the universal laws. You know, everything has two poles, a positive and negative, like a battery. And so at any point in time, you can focus upon either the negative aspect of a situation or thing or being or a positive aspect of it. And that's honestly just up to you and what you choose. For example, maybe, maybe you get in a car crash and that car crash, you might, in that moment, you might be like, oh, damn, this sucks, da 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 it's the worst thing that's ever happened to me in my life. And you could totally perceive that situation like that, and then if you perceive it like that, then that's true. Or you could switch it up and become an alchemist and transmute that thought and say, man, I just got in a car crash, but now, like, I'm gonna use this momentum to propel me forward to start this business that I've been wanting to start so I can make more money again to buy a new car. You know what I'm saying? So that's really all what it's all about. That's what I've been doing in my life, and I found I mean, it's worked out pretty good for me, you know, like, I'm just living life. I get to come out here every single day to somewhere like this. Just vibe in abundance, man. That's what's up. So anyways, honestly, that's just a short video, but that's how I'm feeling, man. It's all about that gratitude and abundance. It's a choice, so choose whatever you want. You know, you can live in scarcity. And if that is your reality, recognize that. It's your choice to move out of that reality because as soon as you start to vibrate towards and move towards living in abundance and living in gratitude, then automatically everything in your life begins to change. And it might not be, sorry, it may not, not be automatically, but it does change. 
know, you have to be patient, patient with everything. That's kind of how it goes. But if you put in the work and you place those intentions and then you move towards it, you have nothing to worry about because it will work. So anyways, that's pretty much what I want to leave you with today. Come back to nature for yourself. Much love everyone, wholeness and balance.